my god, this is the most intense Christmas music I have ever heard. Jesus Christ! Any work to be done in here? Yeah, you want to peel potatoes? I don't know if I'm good at that, <laughs> but I can try. I had a party last night. Bill was, he had about 20 cars there on both sides of the street. Lunchtime. And up on the other end. Dad, I'm glad you got the aluminum trim in here. The wood that they use is nowhere near as nice looking. All right, so it's 4.46. We have been very busy doing stuff. My hands were busy just about all day, so I didn't film much. I do apologize. Anyways, I went over to the bank. I withdrew my uh, savings account funds. Um, one, one of the accounts that I have there. I'm going to leave some other ones that have more money in them. Um, so I withdrew the savings account funds and cash and tried to go over to Chase to deposit those, that money, and since I created the account online, I need written approval from the Social Security Administration Office in either downtown Akron or downtown Cleveland that that is my Social Security number. My birth certificate, my driver's license, and my Social Security card are not good enough forms of ID. So they would not take a couple thousand dollars cash, which now I have to carry around, in my wallet, which is pretty thick in hundreds, um, they won't accept that. They will not let me deposit into that account. I hate First Merit. Chase is just as bad. All of these banks are just dicked. It sucks. So anyways, I'm not going to be able to get over to the office to get that written consent that yes, that is my social security number. I'm not going to be able to get over there until Wednesday. So this is going to take a long time. So I'm going to be carrying this money around. Of course, I'll just leave it at home. I'll lock it up at home or something. But. I cannot believe I walk into a bank with thousands of dollars in cash, hand it to them, tell them to put it in my bank account, and they won't take it because they can't prove who I am. That is absurd. And even being 18 years old, I need a parent or guardian to go with me to do that. I swear, you have no power in this country until you're like 40 years old and you have hundreds of thousands of dollars, hopefully, uh, to your name and or at least an equity. It's just ridiculous how you have no power unless you're so old in this country. Just decked. Alright, so now we're over at Parasons. We're gonna have dinner here at this Italian restaurant. We've been here before. And I'm gonna try to park next to my dad over here and not hit him. Because that would suck. Update. 5.48 p.m. Headed north into the city of Hudson. This guy in the Chevy has been enjoying stoplights with me. I don't know what his deal is. He sees an M5, he thinks I want to play, so he takes off at the lights. He has no idea what he's up against. Yeah, so at uh, 6.30, we got all three, excuse me, grandparents coming over. I, we just had, uh, I had spaghetti and garlic bread, so I've got some hiccups. Anyways, it should be relaxing tonight. Just have some cookies and pie and stuffs with the family. And uh, then tomorrow will be good. It, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film. Uh, quite honestly, it's awkward as hell, but we'll see what we can do. All right. It's 10.44. Everybody just left a little bit ago. We ended up eating dinner at Parasons. I think I filmed that. It's pretty good. Everybody came back here. My aunt, grandparents, mom, sister, everybody. Had a lot of cookies. Had a lot of pie. Sparkling grape juice and wines. It's a good time. Didn't film any of it, beg my part. Anyways, as I said, it's about quarter till 11. I wanna put this together now and get it up before midnight so I can go to bed, so I can get up early tomorrow about 8, 8.30. Um, and I'll try to film tomorrow, no promises. But uh, yeah, second fire of the year. And I'm using the Magnapan speakers tonight. They sound really good. But uh, that's it. So Merry Christmas Eve. By the time you're watching this, it's probably Christmas. So Merry Christmas slash Happy Holidays, whatever you do. Um, that's it for today, guys. So, good night. I'll speak with you tomorrow.